So the next temple in this series of temples of South Mumbai is that temple that is dear to all Mumbaikers and that is the Siddhi Vinayak temple located in the neighborhood of Prabhadevi. The idol of Lord Ganesha is in black stone that is 2 feet uh, 6 inches high and uh, 2 feet wide with the trunk on the right instead of the left. However, he is always covered with vermilion. Sitting in the lotus pose, he is flanked by his consorts Riddhi and Siddhi. The Lord has a third eye akin to Lord Shiva's third eye and a snake is entwined like a sacred thread on the deity. The walls of the Sanctum Sanctorum are constructed using the Jaisalmer uh, sandstone and uh, the Sanctum is a spacious octagonal structure with three ornate doors through which uh, the devotees can enter in lines. And uh, so uh, there is also a vermilion covered idol of Lord Hanuman just opposite the shrine and it has its own sets of uh, rituals every day. Now this idol was found during a road extension project in 1952. And, the, and then this present day six story structure was uh, you know, built according to the Vastu and Shilpa Shastras and it was uh, inaugurated with a Kumbhavishekam ceremony on 13 July 1994. Uh, so what is interesting is that the octagonal structure of the temple is directly above the crown of the deity, uh, deity and uh, you know Siddhi Vinay Ganapati. So the temple has uh, been covered extensively by international media and uh, therefore you can find a number of videos about it uh, all over um, the internet. Now it is supposed to be the richest temple in Mumbai and garners donations of nearly to you know 100 to 150 million rupees per year. Now it is uh, been recorded and that the temple was built by a contractor named Lakshman Vittu Patil and was funded by a lady called Devai Patil and this was back in the uh, uh, 19th century and since she was childless Devai built the temple so that the Lord should grant children to other women who could not uh, have children. So it was uh, consecrated uh, uh, on 19 November 1801. And uh, besides uh, the uh, deity, uh, now you also find two huge silver mice statues that are found, you know that are kept outside in the center in the uh, prahar. So you will find the devotees whispering into their ears so that they convey their uh, deepest wishes or most um, intimate wishes to Lord Ganesha. And um, of course, the temple grew in popularity and. During the 1960s and 70s, the temple became so popular that it became very difficult to control the crowd. So the government then stepped in and formed the Siddhi Vinayak Trust with prominent citizens as board of trustees to oversee its um, smooth functioning. And so every time actually you visit the temple, it is such a well-organized uh, temple. They have uh, the tightest security. Then there are these um, uh, shops uh, which uh, are surround the temple where you can buy your offerings or leave your footwear there. Um, and uh, the queue system is very well organized. Um, the pilgrims are also very, very uh, disciplined and wait for the turn to go in. Now with this temple, uh, unless I visit another temple in the South, in the South Mumbai area, I would think that this would be the last video but uh, never say never you never know where I'll go next so I hope you enjoyed this series leave me a comment about uh, how you enjoyed the series about the temples in South Mumbai this is Sangeeta Venkatesh and until next time um, Namaste